right, guys. What do you say, boys? How are we feeling today? Good? I trust we all slept well after that beautiful win last night. Another night where a bunch of pitches come. Listen to this. Listen, yeah, a bunch of pitches. Oh, yeah. Pretty soon, no more starting pitches. Going to use all relief pitches. Got a whole smorgasbord of pitches. A whole, a whole cavalcade of pitches. A whole slew of pitches. No more complete game. We're going to use all relief pitches. Everybody's going to pitch. We're going to rotate on the infield. After the, the pitcher throws three pitches, the third base comes in and we rotate like in volleyball. We're going to have one pitcher per batter. How's that? If everybody on the field pitches, we're going to have the fans come in from the stands and we're all going to pitch. Well, anyway, five great stats, though. Five pitches last night combined for two runs, nine hits, one home run, eight singles. Nice. Nice. But, guys, we left 24 men on base. 24 fucking men. Do you realize that's almost as much as the, that the Indians' historical 21 winning streak? 21 fucking guys left on base? Mind-boggling. Frazier, look at this. They both look at me. You. You went 0 for 4. You left 8 men on base. Come on. Come on, guys. In a tight game, we, we can't leave 24 guys on base. I look. Thank God we're at a Shea Stadium. Whatever the fuck you want to call that place. That, that place is fucking weird. I think I saw Ed Cranepool selling hot dogs. But we're back in the stadium, baby. We're back in the, in the, in the fucking plastic replica of the cathedral. Yeah, playgrounds and all. And you know who we're playing? You know who we're playing tonight? The Balti Hall Glory Holes. Well, well, well. Seven and a half games behind us with 17 games to play. Looks like that old genius Buck Shaw Walter didn't do it again. Genius. Nostradamus was a genius. Einstein was a genius. Why is everybody called Shaw Walter a genius? Yeah, the genius who managed two teams who won a World Series the year after he left them. Buck Showalter is such a genius that he has his teams under 500. Fuck him in his dirty fucking neck. I want to pummel these guys, okay? I think we're going to hit tonight. Go to mybookie.ag. Use the promo code capitals VIC. They'll match your startup bonus 100%. My wife is betting the over tonight. I can't. The guys can't. But you can. The over is nine and a half. I won, I mean, my wife won uh, with the under with the Giants Sunday night, and she won the under with the Yankees Tuesday night. Yankees, over. Tonight, mybookie.ag. All right. Let's talk about Balti Hall for a moment, shall we? The pitching is horrible, okay? This team is all about the bullpen, gentlemen. So let's knock them around early and often so the closes stay away and we feast on that bullshit pitching of theirs. But these pricks can hit. Oh, can they hit. The pitching is their Achilles heel. The hitting's are scary, if you ask me. They have seven guys with 20 or more home runs. Do you realize that? Stoop is killing it. Macho and Mrs. Jones and Dumbo and fucking Lou Ferrigno. This is a tough lineup, up and down the batting order. So let, let's play smart, guys. Let's pitch them tough. Tanaka, yes, Tanaka. Please. Baltimore is on, stop it, Tanaka, I'm getting dizzy. Baltimore is on their knees. They'll probably give up runs. Let's start to get into a playoff mindset, okay, guys? All right, I don't know what I'm going to do about the lineup tonight. I'm, I, I'm still trying to figure this shit out. Do I rest judge? Do I play judge? Bird flew the fucking coop. It's like managing a fucking triage in this place. Let me think about it. But you're professionals, guys. Just be ready to play. Let's get out there and get warmed up. 
One more game closer to the goal. One more game, boys. One more game closer to the fucking goal. Now get the fuck out of my faces.